Yo, what's up guys? Welcome back to my channel. My name is Mr. Lawrence and in today's video I will show you how to get green joggers. We will need to use Beth, so you will need two consoles or a console from a trusted friend and also Netcat on your PC or laptop. The download link for Netcat will be in the description below. So in this video, C1 is console 1 and C2 is console 2. First sign in on C2 and load into story mode. Then open your pause menu, go to online, play GT online and hover over invite only session. Then sign in on the same account on C1. C2 will get signed out and then just follow the video. But before we begin, check out Messi Money. They provide multiple GTA services such as modded accounts, money and rank boost for all platforms. They deliver fast, they are reliable and it's 100% safe. The link will be in the description below and let's get straight into the video. First you will need any pair of colored joggers to flip the color to green. I will show you the easiest method. Now open your interaction menu, go to map blip options, jobs and make sure stunt race is set on show. You should now see this job. Now register as a CEO. In order to become a CEO, you will need to own an office. Go to management, then to style and select the warlord outfit. When you have this outfit, start the stunt race on your own. When you're on this screen, just quit the race. When you are back, quickly run inside the clothing store and go into a clothing section, then wait till it kicks you from this menu. Now retire from being a CEO and then remove all your clothing items on your outfit except for the joggers. When you did that, save this outfit in any empty slot and name it C1. I'm also doing it with a colored helmet, but I will show how to do that in another video. Then head over to the pants. cargo pants and purchase the blue digital cargo, number 29. Now save this outfit in another empty slot and name it C2. It's easier if you have C1 and C2 saved next to each other. So your C1 outfit should have any colored joggers and your C2 outfit should have the blue digital cargo pants. Now equip your C1 outfit again and also equip a classic parachute bag. If you don't have one, you can go to the ammunition. Wait for the yellow loading circle in the bottom right corner and then go to Netcat. Find your C1 console by looking at the IP address. From here, you will need to click the blue Wi-Fi symbol to lag your connection. Then wait for about 10 to 20 seconds. This depends on your internet speed so you may have to wait a little bit longer. Then sign in on C2 and start an invite only session. So C1 and C2 should both still be signed in. You will also only have about 2 minutes to do this this part. Once you are in online, quickly equip your C2 outfit and also equip the classic parachute again. Wait for the yellow save icon and go back to story mode. Now go back to C1 and have Netcat ready. Take off your parachute, then close your interaction menu and click on the red Wi-Fi symbol to reconnect your connection. You will now get a signed out alert on C1. Accept all the alerts and wait till you're in story mode. When you are in story mode, start an invite only session. I also want to remind you guys to drop a like if you're enjoying the video and also subscribe with post notice. When you are back in online, you should have the green joggers and you can now make your own custom outfits with green joggers. If you have any questions, comment it down below and I will catch you in the next one. Bye bye.